Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, it is a beautiful Wednesday morning here in Austin, Texas. Uh, this is day 827 of the Three Plus Minutes of Life Challenge. And as always, I am filled with gratitude. Thoughts in my mind this morning. I've been in a bit of a funk for the last couple of days. Um, there has been the recovery that's gone a little bit longer than I anticipated from my uh, marathon on Saturday. There is this space of feeling like I don't know what's next and struggling to figure out what next is. Um, there's been this, some moments of self-doubt, there's some, some fear of the unknown. All of these things have just come all together at one time to just beat me up. There's also been some parts of it where I felt like there's some actions that I had to correct. And so I've been struggling the last couple of days. It's been rainy here in Austin. And, uh, you know, I just, you know, every day is in sunshine. <laughs> um, and so, but I keep going on. Like I keep doing the things that I, I know that work for me. So I keep doing these exercises. Um, I'm taking a Bible study class, of course. I've been doing that the last two, three days. Um, and then the other day, my brother, Evan, reached out to me and he invited me to come to uh, a warrior night for men at uh, his church, which is uh, Austin Ridge here in Austin. And initially when he asked me, I was like, oh, I really didn't want to go. Um, but I think it was in that moment that I knew that I needed to go. So it took me about 50 minutes to get there last night. And I said, okay, God, what you got for me? <laughs> something I need to hear, something I need to do. So I went. And the first thing that struck me when I walked into the auditorium, there were thousands of men in this church, thousands of only men in this church. And it took me aback, actually. It scared me initially. And then all of a sudden, it was just this feeling of peace that started to come over me that this many men could be in one space. It ended up being about 2,000 men. And, and though you're not talking to each and every one of them, it's like this feeling of building each other up because we all knew who we are and what we've been in. Then the worship was amazing. <laughs> and the pastor Brad talked about David and Bathsheba and talked about the story and how, uh, how much of a man of God he was. He still had a sinful nature. And he still had to overcome some of his sins and transgressions. And it just spoke to me. It, it brought my spirits up. And although I'm not fully back to what I normally am, it got me into a better space than what I was. And for that, I am forever grateful. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> this is hitting me right now. As always, be blessed today and every day. Talk to you soon. Peace.